This is the derangement and subfactorial calculator for MathCelebrity.com. There's a few ways you can get there. You can type the standard notation, something like this, six derangements. You could type six subfactorial, or you could type six derangements. We'll go ahead and do the standard notation. So we'll go ahead and do exclamation point and then your number, which is opposite of factorial. Press the calculator or return key. So here's our calculator, and if you're on the calculator, you just enter your derangement number here. We describe what a derangement is here, and then we list the formula here. We plug in our numbers. Now we simplify the factorial piece, which is here down here. So 6 factorial is 720. We continue on now that we know our factorial, plug in our numbers, simplify and evaluate. So 6 subfactorial is the floor of 265.373, etc. Now what we do to get you from here to here, we'll link you to our floor calculator. Real quickly, I'll show you this. This just describes what a floor is. And basically, that's the lowest integer below your decimal. So in this case, 265. So finally, we get our subfactorial number. That's pretty much it. Uh, let's run, run one more problem. We'll use our Generate Practice Problem button. We got six this time. Okay, now we got seven. Let's run seven subfactorial. Again, same thing as last problem. We run through here's a description, our formula, plug our numbers in. Seven factorial is 5,040. Plug and chug, link to our floor calculator, and we get 1854. So that's pretty much it. If you do have any questions or enhancement suggestions, as usual, use the contact us link. Thanks for watching.